Hey, KIC here. Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. We have business to take care of. Hello, Mr. Apex Carno. You need a name. You are Red Don. Thank you, Chris Allen, for your suggestion. In the last episode, I asked you for names for that guy and said, uh, not yet on that guy. And I think by the end of this episode, we should have a decision on whether this guy is going to have a name or not. And it might actually revolve around, is he still alive? Because look at that. He lost health. He's at 1,000 health. This guy, he lost even more. He's at 14,000 health. What happened? Yeah, one of the patches happened. That's what happened. Uh, one of the most recent patches was a big balancing act. And the devs are still working on it. So none of this is quite finalized just yet. Uh, you know what? Come to think of it. No, let's... Uh, Let's bring Red Dawn here. I, I think we probably need him out here, especially since uh, little Carno's not mm, super tough. Anyway, devs are trying to balance things. You know, they're trying to get everything so that it all works together nicely. Everything fits together and it all sounds great. And in doing so, they basically made it so that your dinosaurs lose a lot of health compared to what they had before. And by the way, if things look a little funky right now, I'm experimenting with some settings, and holy cow, I don't think I like these. I'm going to have to go back to what I was doing before. I, I was trying to get a little more performance out of the game, just so that it's, um, wow, this is terrible. Uh, a little, I don't know, I guess a little better for me while I'm playing, and, uh, you know, I don't feel like I'm playing a slideshow, because sometimes it feels like a slideshow, but this is quite terrible, so my apologies. I will uh, not do this next time around. <laughs> That looks really bad. What are you up there? Are you a Stego? You look like a Stego. Yep, you're a Stego. You're a Stego. Everyone ever noticed that it sounds like Stego? I don't know. That doesn't mean anything. Never mind. Anyway, we're talking about the patch. It changed a whole host of stuff. So, yeah, I don't know. I just, I don't know. Dinosaurs lost a lot of damage. In fact, um, I didn't even look. What are you at? I don't remember what you were at. 159. What are you at? You were at 300. <laughs> oh, man. Ah, oh, man. Man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. It's like I'm playing back on my old school default settings right now. Seriously, this is crazy. Ah, eh, free for a cap. Why not? 100. I could have sworn you were just at more than that. Maybe it was this guy. Wow, you are even lower than I thought. Holy cow. You're at 144% damage? Oh. This is just terrible. Terrible. Man. That is brutal. Holy cow. I, I don't even know what to say about this. This is... Wow. This is a lot... A lot worse than I thought it was going to be. Now I understand why everyone's upset. Then again, you know, I am playing on a local game. So I guess I can kind of do my own thing, really. How long is it going to take to kill an Oviraptor? Really? Wow. Okay, sure, it was level 60. But, um... Wow. You know, the other thing that... The big change with all this... Is that... When you lose all that melee damage... Oh, I don't even know what to do now. Oh, that is worthless. 2.7% damage. Oh, man. This guy went from being pretty good to... Almost worthless, really. Oh, this is awful. Yeah, one of the bad things about all that damage loss, though, is you don't harvest as much. So that's not necessarily a... a well, I don't know, I guess. <laughs> it depends on your creature. If you had a... A creature that had 3,000 melee damage, or 3,000%, and all of a sudden it's knocked down to, I don't know, 500 or something like that. Man, you're talking about a severe de decrease, I can't speak, in the number of materials you're going to get. Oh, man. This is, um, wow, this is terrible. I don't know of a polite way to put it, other than to say this is terrible. What happens when I harvest? Uh, I guess that hasn't changed. That looks about right. 64. Yeah, I think that's probably about right. Let's go ahead and harvest another one here. I'm going to grab a bunch of stones. I don't know why. No, actually, I was thinking of doing a little building today. But I'm not sure how I'm feeling about all of this stuff now. This is, um... Wow, this is crazy. This is, uh... 
not what I was expecting. Not at all. Not at all. Wow. I mean, I knew things had changed, but... Uh, hmm. You, you don't want to hold more than that? You can't hold more than that. Wow. The Apex creatures are severely broken. I'm just going to go ahead and say that right now. Those guys are way, way broken. Yeah. That's all right. The mod isn't perfect. I'm not expecting it to be. But they are broken. There is no question of that one. Or I guess they're just not meant to be... I guess they're just not meant to be callers. So maybe that's unfair to say they're broken. Excuse me, Meganora. Don't fly in front of my axe because I will hit you. I have no, no problem with doing that. We're going to build a couple of foundations here. Yeah, I'm going to do them out of wood. Just because I'm only going to do one. Because I need more fiber, apparently. I need more fiber in my diet. How'd that happen? How'd I go from having thousands of fiber to having none? I think because I put all of them in my crafting table, my smithy. There we go. So let's go ahead and go into structures, wood. That way I don't have to keep typing foundation every single time. Instead, I just have to hunt around and try to find where it is in the list. That sounds much better, right? Right. Um, I think I had a bunch of thatch, so let's just grab some wood. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because... I'm going to go ahead and start by putting a some sort of foundation, obviously a foundation down, for some sort of building over here. I, I don't know what it's going to look like. We're just, we're kind of winging this. I mean, with all the changes to everything, I don't know, we're kind of winging it. I, I don't know what's going to happen at this point. I'm feeling, uh, honestly, I'm feeling a little discouraged. I'm feeling a little discouraged. I mean, thankfully, I am playing a single player game, so I can modify settings if I decide that I don't like how this is going, but... I'm not gonna lie. I'm really feeling a little feeling a little discouraged by some of these changes. They're they just um, I don't know. I get it. You gotta balance things. You can't have stuff being super crazy and getting I don't know tons of uh, everything from everything and anything. I get it. I totally get that. I'm not complaining about that at all. Uh, I and I, I've thought for a long while that this game actually needs some balancing done to it. But gotta say I'm a little disappointed in what it's kind of feeling like to play. That's a little, um, I don't know, it's a little much. Or not a lot, or not enough, or something. I don't know how you want to phrase that. It just, it feels a little excessive, the, the changes. And it's funny because they were actually bumped back up. Even though everything was kind of knocked down, the devs then kind of tuned things back up to be, uh, they said close to where they were. And of course, on an unofficial server or in a single player game, you can just kind of make stuff be what you want, but, um, yeah, I guess since I'm not running an actual server, I don't really have the same access to everything I did on my previous series because you don't quite have the same options available to you when you're playing single player. You don't have that... Um, well, maybe I don't know. Maybe you do. Maybe you do have it available. I haven't tried playing with the game I and I in a single player fashion to see what it does because all the controls are kind of in the menu to begin with, so it didn't seem like something I need to do, but uh, maybe I do. Wow, I am so heavy now I cannot move. So let's start that up. And there's the pause for saving, and away we go. We're going to go slap these guys down, and yes, I know, I'm kind of chopping from way far out, and I left the, the dinosaurs way over there, which I probably shouldn't have done. I should probably have the Carno over here. Where are you, Carno? Can I get you? You are you are too far away from me. I can't target you. Nope. I, I'm trying. I tried. There we go. Come over here, Carno. You're going to be a big pack mule for the moment. So, there you go. Take 40 pounds of that stuff. Do I have anything else I can really dump on you? Not a whole lot. I mean, I guess I could get rid of some of these berries I'm carrying, but that's alright. We're not going to worry about that. In fact, we're just going to chop some more trees down because we need some more wood here. And then we'll go get started on a foundation and kind of plopping some walls down. We're going to make some walls next. So that's why I'm doing this a little more because we got to have walls. We're going to have a foundation. That only makes sense. I'm not saying we're going to put a door on anything. Don't get crazy. Don't get crazy. I'm not saying we're going to put doors down. Don't get crazy. But I am saying we are going to put walls down. At least six of them, if not seven. Of course, that means getting more wood, and that'll have to take a moment here. But, you know, just saying. Don't don't get crazy on me here. Let's grab some more of this stuff. All right, all right, all right, all right. We're looking good so far. It's pretty quiet over here. I'm kind of surprised there's really nothing going on. I mean, this is kind of a, a quiet area inside of what is otherwise, um, I don't know, kind of nasty area. Uh, that would be a dodo up there that is stuck on 
a tree, I imagine. Can I get up there and free you, Dodes? Dodo. Get out of here. You're fine. Look at that. And I don't even care about your egg. That's how little I care about Dodo eggs. I'm not going to take a free Dodo egg. What's the point? It doesn't even matter. Carno. Hold some walls. We got nine of them. All right. I'm feeling pretty good. We're going to go for ten. At least ten. We're going for ten walls. Eleven walls. Forty-seven wa No, not going for forty-seven walls. That would be insane. We're not doing that. That's a little too much for one day, I think. Everyone has a limit. Hey, look at that. There's Parasaur right there. I'm curious. What happens if I sick my dinosaurs on it? Since it is stuck, it's not going anywhere. Hello? Can I sick my dinosaurs on you? There you go. What happens? Level 76 Parasaur. I guess it died quickly enough, but... Still, it is, um... I don't know. It's a little disconcerting. I'm gonna go ahead and let Carno here harvest from the body. And then we can have him follow again. Just check in your inventory. Uh, you got 42 meat from that guy. That's what I wanted to check. I wanted to see that. Because remember, with that drop in melee damage, that actually affects how much they're going to harvest. It's all tied back to melee damage in terms of what you're harvesting. So maybe I should up, I should up my own melee damage instead of being... Uh, uh, you know what? Fine. Let's, let's do that. I was originally going up toward 150 and I didn't quite make it. Ooh, level 60. Look at that. We probably have some stuff we can do. Some stuff we can play with. I kind of hope so, because, um... I don't know, I wasn't too excited by the stuff that opened up at 55. In fact, I didn't even show you, because it was so underwhelming. There really wasn't anything there. So let's go ahead and grab one more tree's worth of materials. And we're going to load the Carno up with all of these walls. You can have those five right there. Thank you very much. And we're going to hop on you, and you are weighed down and cannot move. Good. Can you move now? Yep, you can move now. Good. So we're going to walk back to where we're going to build, apparently, because Carno cannot move with all the stuff I dropped on him. Yeah, I think he's going to die. I'm just going to say it right now. I really think he's going to die. If there were an Apex Raptor over here, I'm pretty sure he'd be dead. Oh, that's bad. Anytime you see those alerts pop up on your phone, that's not a good thing. Eh, Amber Alerts, not a good thing. Not a good thing. That means someone has done something bad. Hello, Compy. I hope there aren't other ones around because you might start chewing on me if there are, and I don't want to be chewed on today. That's not why. I, that's not what I signed up for. Uh, did you stop following? You stopped following. Good. We're going to run up here. Uh, you would be a Carno. Hello, Carno. Um, just out of curiosity, what are you? Maybe we should tame you, huh? Ah, uh, you're level 8. Oh, uh, you are a female, though. Ah, uh, we'll think about it. Since you're not going to go anywhere, we'll just let you kind of hang right there. And we're going to wander up to... The shelf kind of right here. Now, I have thought about maybe going up even higher to build up there, and uh, we might need to do that for walls or something along those lines a little later on. Assuming all of this even works, um, a lot of assumptions are being made right now. Let's go ahead and bring these guys over here. We're going to have park them uh, right about here. This looks good. You can park right there. Now, I would like those foundations, please, so I'm going to grab all those. I am not able to move around with all these foundations, so maybe if I eat some berries, I can move. Let's see. Oh, look at that. That is painful. Let's go ahead and drop some stuff. I don't need 10 pounds of those, or 9 pounds, or whatever that was. I'm not even paying attention. I don't care. We'll go ahead and throw those down there. And there we go. I'm moving quickly enough. I'm fine with that, and I'll eat some more of these. Even though I don't need to eat any more food, I will eat them. I will gorge myself on berries. Yum, berries, yum, 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 blah, blah, berries, blah. good. All right, now, let's go ahead and set some foundations down. We're going to put one right there. How is that for specific and taking my time to place everything exactly where it belongs? I have no clue where it belongs. That just looked fine to me. We're going to slap all these guys down like so. Now, I kind of like the idea of maybe having one or two over here. That way we kind of have a little patio that overlooks... The water. I think that's a good idea, right? We can put maybe like some railings up, something along those lines. I mean, we have railings. We might as well use them. That's kind of my thought. So yes, I realize this is wood. It's not going to last, but that's okay. You can kind of do things in this game where you can put stuff down and then you can just place a new one right over it. So we're popping down some... Come on, let's walk forward. We're popping down some wooden foundations and that's fine because we can actually upgrade those a little later on to... Um, we're not going to put one right there. We're not going to put a wall right there. Uh, I don't know where the door is going to go. Remember, we're not putting doors down. I um, feel like that's a door right there. But we're not doing doors today. No doors. Don't don't get crazy. No doors today. Um, 
Yeah, I'm feeling like this is okay. And then, uh, let's see. Yep, you are facing the correct direction. You never know. I never know, anyway. It seems like things go funky sometimes. Now, some of these will probably end up turning into windows, and that's totally cool. I'm on board with that. I hope you're on board with that as well. We're going to put a couple of walls down up here, so we're going to go up high. This is going to be at least two high, if not three high. I'm not entirely certain how we're going to go with that just yet. Let's go ahead and bring this guy up, and let's do railing. We're going to do a wooden railing. So let's learn that. Um, do I not have wooden wall? Why Why am I not able to... Oh, I already did learn it. Duh. Why didn't someone tell me I already learned it? I swear, sometimes I'm just such an idiot. If you were a wooden railing, where would you be? You would be right there, and you would need more fiber. So let's go and grab some more fiber, and then we'll uh, kind of have the beginnings of a makeshift building. Wow, is there nothing over here? You? No. Not you. Um... Come on, something. It's gotta be something to harvest over here. Oviraptor, where where are you hiding all of the fiber? I should have grabbed 500 or so before I left. Bouncy, bouncy! Alright, there's some right there. Say hi to the Carno. Hi, Carno. Hello, Carno. 20 fiber, 22 fiber, 31 fiber. Boom, perfect, good. We don't need any more than that. And let's go ahead and queue up some railings. We're gonna need at least three of them. That'll be fine. We'll do three railings. And then we will grab these guys right here. We're going to throw them down onto number six, because that's where they belong. Uh, I'm still not feeling good about the Carno. The whole Carno thing is just worrying me a little bit. Uh, you know, whatever. We'll figure it out as it goes. I needed four of them. Eh, whatever. Let's pop you down. We'll go there. We'll go right there. I'm going to hit number six. So we're going to call it an episode right here. We have the beginnings of a building. I'm not saying this is it. Not by a long shot. Nope, 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 nope. Got it? No. Not done. Not done at all. Not done. Not done. Not saying we're done. But we are done with this episode. So we have Red Dawn over here. And I'm going to ask you right now for names for this guy. You want to name him? Throw me a name. Put them in the comments. And when we meet again, I will have a name for this one based upon your suggestions. I will pick a random name and I will let you know on the next episode what this guy's called and uh with any luck he'll still be alive at that point actually <laughs> that's a minor concern but we won't worry too much about that so if you enjoyed this one do me a favor leave a thumbs up if you didn't leave a thumbs down do consider subscribing if you haven't already and i will catch you on the next one so until then thanks for watching see you later <laughs>